Have you ever wondered where a road goes? A road back of beyond, beyond the foresty trunk road. A road that doesn't show up on most maps. But Google Earth says there's something there. Well, that's what we did here. And the road is called Wild Horse Road. The road is managed by West Fraser, a forestry company that owns sundry forest products. We took my 4x4 and surprisingly only got 3 kilometers up the road. We parked just above the old Husky oil site. Have you ever seen a more secure gate? And look at the site security watching us. The plan was to go 10 kilometers up the road. Now, just over 3 kilometers in, we had just 7 kilometers to go on foot. So off we went. We hiked for 7.5 kilometers. It was about 13 degrees Celsius overcast, with light rain and low cloud cover. That meant we couldn't see the top of Wild Horse Ridge very often, but it added to the hush over the land. It was wonderfully peaceful throughout. There were three main areas of the hike. First, there was the deforested or logged area. Second, there was a ford across Wild Horse Creek. And third, the forested section. The first thing we saw in the logged area was a makeshift gun range. The road was fair to Midland with all manner of puddles and a bog. The surprise of the hike was Wild Horse Creek. It was an easy cross by foot. the area of the creek we explored could very well have been a camping spot. The forest area was the stillest. Drainage of the trail was just as poor as everywhere else. We did a bit to help that along. And we did some clearing. There are traces from the wild horses and deer. We startled a grouse and saw some squirrels. On the way back, we noticed someone drove out to the bog and back while we were hiking. Otherwise, there was no one out there. It was a Tuesday. Now you too know a bit about Wild Horse Road.